Hi everyone! Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to unbox a smart doll. And it's one I have been waiting for for almost a year. And when she was released, a friend of mine uh, managed to uh, grab her for me. And now she has finally arrived and I'm so happy. Um, so let's first start and open this box. Easy enough. Uh, put this away. And here is the bag in which all smart dolls come. And it says keep calm and carry a smart doll. And then there is the box. Uh, which holds the accessories and it's always placed on top of the door oh that's so cute I got a couple of extras from my friend thank you so much I love it some really super cute uh, coasters I really love it thank you and a couple of bookmarks that's also great really love it uh, and what's this oh that's a cute ball um, thank you so much uh, here is the stand it, it's the new type I think uh, I'm not sure if I have any of these already or if this is the newest uh, that I got I know Danny is planning to make them in orange so uh, they will change again. Um, put this aside. Here's the card, and of course it says uh, a couple of things like uh, warnings: uh, avoid getting fingers pinched in joints. For prolonged periods in strong light, keep joints dry. Whatever you do, do not fit feed after midnight. <laughs> Use stain prevention measures if using dark clothing. And you can find more at the shop. So this is her wig. It's called a cherry wig. So I will get it out. Although I may put my own doll in a different wig, but we'll see. Smart doll wigs are really great. Uh, useful quality. And it has a nice curl to it, as you can see. It has a light head cap inside and here is my girl yes it is a girl um, and I don't know if you can see it but she is T and it is T independent so let me get her out Oh wow! Oh gosh, guys, she really is just like I imagined. Wow! She's got a new under underwear set. Uh, it's the grey set, and it says, "With Smartle, the future is in your hands." It's a grey one as opposed to the white ones they always came with uh, it's crossed at the back so that's cute too uh, now let me see how she looks in the red wig she comes with it's a very pretty wig and it really makes her blue eyes pop 
Now I'm still thinking to get her green eyes. Because I like that. So I had a little break and I cleaned up a bit. Uh, this is her. Uh, beautiful face and uh, as I said before uh, the red wig really makes her uh, blue eyes pop so that's really pretty I love how she looks in this uh, but I had a different look in mind for her so I will see how that looks uh, this is uh, my wig uh, which I bought uh, at Etsy and I ought to give her this wig. Uh, no, I just need to see. It's a bit... Uh, <laughs> it never wants to do what I want, which is especially <laughs> exactly how my own hair type is, <laughs> to be honest. Um, but I really like this. And I think I'm going to buy uh, new eyes for her, uh, which should be green, because I really love this on her. Now I'm going to pop her on some clothes. Um, I've got this uh, cute uh, sketch here. Uh, it's from uh, Etsy seller Hina Garden. And, um, so to dress the smart dolls you can just take off their arms and their head. Now I'm going to take off the bra as I like uh, I like it better to let them wear their clothing without the bra. Uh, the default uh, bust is called a small bust and to me that's big enough. I'm not really a fan of the larger bust, but each to its own. Uh, and I know some people really like, well there are a lot of people who really like the medium smooth bust and uh, the medium smooth bust and uh, it's really uh, some clothing looks better with it on, so I can imagine why. I also have uh, the excess bust in the uh, tea. Um, and I like that a lot, but not all of the smart old clothing looks as well with it. So. Here we have the, um, I think it was called Tokyo jeans, uh, they are the ones that are uh, washed, uh, some washed and have some uh, holes in them. And I really like these jeans. She also has one of the uh, original belt always a bit tight to put on something uh, that's too bit there we go again and shoes these 
these are just some cheap shoes I got off uh, eBay, I think. Uh, uh, when you search uh, BJD uh, shoes 7.5 cm, uh, they might show up. I have quite a few of them because I just really like them on my dolls. and uh, I love the footwear uh, from Culture Japan, but uh, they are more expensive, so if your budget isn't uh, so that you can buy a lot of footwear from them, you, it's, it's possible to get really cheap ones of eBay or AliExpress, and uh, it works. Let's see. How to put her head back on. Yes, the wig is not so tight as the uh, Culture Japan wig. Uh, but <laughs> I just really like this wig because of the color and uh, also because of the model of the, the wig. So I'm keeping this one for her anyway. So here she is. My independence. Um, I will show you her backstory, and uh, I posted that story on my Instagram uh, last year, the first of June, and it really means a lot to me. The story. Uh, it really helped me through uh, some difficulties. Uh, and uh, help me to uh, handle them in a better way than I would have done in the past. So um, this doll also really means a lot to me. Uh, just like Resilient, uh, I also have Resilient and also her backstory is one that uh, I shared that same day because the combination of those two stories really worked for me. So that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Let me know in the comments uh, what, which smart doll you like the best and if there's a backstory of a smart doll which really speaks to you. That's it. Thank you. Bye for now.